Welcome to the best incorporated soldering tip of the day. This demonstration is going to be performed by Norman Meir, Master IPC Trainer. Today's soldering tip is chip component preparation using the dry tack method. To complete this procedure, your instructor will be using no clean flux and a chisel tip. Select the correct size of chisel tip by matching the tip to the work. The iron tip should be approximately the same size as the component termination. The first step in any soldering procedure is to clean the area. Using a clean, lint-free cloth and isopropyl alcohol, wipe the area clean of any residues or contaminants which may interfere with a good solder connection. Next, align the component to the pads. While some misalignment is allowed per the IPC standards, it is a good practice to align the component to the best of your ability. Apply flux to the area being soldered. Gently hold the component in place with a tweezers or other fine point tool. After cleaning the soldering iron tip, apply the iron to the pad and the component termination. The dry tack method relies on the component termination tinning to temporarily hold the component in place. The component is now tacked in place. From this point, the component can be processed as necessary. The advantage to the dry tack is control of the final amount of solder on the termination. This has been a best incorporated soldering tip of the day, chip component preparation using the dry tack method. For more soldering tips and training, please visit our website at www.solder.net.